Hi guys, it's Darren here from DeepBlueApps.com. We've got a brand new giveaway. It's completely free to all Resource Center members, so go over to Deep Blue Apps now, download the Resource Center, and you will get access to this. Now, basis for this one is a couple of weeks ago I had an idea trying to get the cubic character to jump properly, um, not just go diagonally down. So like I've said, I really tried to uh, figure out how I could make him jump uh, more realistically in the uh, true vein of the original Cubit game. I think we've managed that, this here. Um, we've also put some enemies in and we've got a few levels but I'll just quickly show you. It's joystick operated. It takes the angle of the joystick so you get a nice control there. Like I've said we've got three different enemy types in. You notice a blue one once it gets to the bottom. That'll then turn back round and start chasing our little Cubit. You can't use the character because it's been ripped from the original Cubit game. Uh, everything else you can use as you wish. You can see the green one's coming down, that one takes away the blocks you've already collected so that one's a bit nasty. And the red one will simply come down and choose a random path all the way down to the bottom. See I've died there. Now like I've said I've put some uh, different levels in. If you go into the uh, the brick actor here, the block actor sorry, change the max hit count to 2, level to 2, go back in the game. You'll now notice that you have to change the blocks twice, you have to get them to a yellow colour for them to register a count. Got some spinning discs here like I've said, they work rather nicely. So a little bit more tricky because you do have to actually turn the blocks to yellow so you have to hit, hit them twice. And last but not least I've put in, just change that to level 3. This is even harder because you do have to change the blocks twice still to yellow but if you do actually go back over them which I'm going to do now, it will actually change them back to blue. So you've got a few levels in there to play with and three different enemy types. With it being a free template, I'm not going to be offering any support for this. There is no notes in there because I wasn't planning to uh, release this for free. It was just a couple of hours, one afternoon of me messing around. So it is as it, it, is, as it, as it is basically. Um, if you can learn something from it, that's great. Use it as you wish. Um, you can. There's enough information here to make your own block jumping type cubic game um, but yeah have fun with it guys and like I've said it's available over at DBA absolutely free if you download our resource center so take care guys speak to you soon